This this thing is not working. Don't tell me that does not look good as hell. It's pretty spacious back here, no cap. So today I'm heading off to Detroit, Michigan to get a new car. I've been driving around my Honda CRV for like the last five years and you know, it's, it's a pretty good car. It's been taking me to places A and B. Um, it's pretty run down. I love the space in the back and the reliability on this thing is insane. My 2006 car 2023 is really starting to get a bit too old and I definitely do need an upgrade. All I gotta do now is take a bus ride over to Detroit and go see my new car. Just look how great the sky is and just all the air around. So this is the second time the air is actually like this and it's because of the Canadian fires up in like Quebec, I think. But anyway, this is my very first time running on like a charter transit bus that I actually paid for uh, to like a different city. The bus must have been like brand new because everything was in like mint condition. But I decided just to sit back, relax and enjoy the views. Thank you. Okay. All right, finally in Detroit now. Oh my God, we're in downtown Detroit. I haven't been in downtown Detroit in a minute, but now all I gotta do is call up a lift. Assalamu alaikum. How's your day today? Very, very, very good. Take care, okay. You too, man. Appreciate it. Thank you. All right, so Tom, all we have to do now is just pick up the car. I think we're chilling. Uh, did you give me my shoes, brother? Yes. I'm just, I'm good to go now, right? I forgot to record all the inside stuff and me giving them the insurance papers and everything, but we're finally here. Finally got it. Got to put on that air tag real quick. Oh, uh, not a lot of room for my camera. I guess that's kind of good but I don't have the tripod on. It's still a bit more room than the CRV because I would not be able to fit that thing anywhere. So thankfully this is kind of good. I do got to just uh, put in a few accessories here. Like this bad boy. There we go. This is the first car that I have that actually has like a touch screen, a touch screen in the, in the car. This this thing is not working. Oh, it finally worked. When me, my dad, and my brother came to check out the car over the weekend, like that button was not working at all. It was kind of being weird, right? But thankfully, I think it really was just the heat and the sun like staring at the screen and it's all good now. It was actually a food truck that was hitting me up not too long ago to try some of their food. So I guess we can go see what's up with them. <laughs> This guy just made me go through like the most narrow little area in between cars to the gate that I, he could actually possibly make. But we got through. This is the place right here, up next to this gas station. Hello! Um, I was asked to come eat by you guys at this place. What's the thing that usually people get around here? So our best seller is the Detroit Blue, which is more Yeah, I'll take some fries as well. Oh yeah, this is about to be good. Open up that ketchup. What did it say? It was roasted jalapeno ketchup. Okay. Nice and crispy, man. Honestly, the smell of the garlic is definitely stronger than the actual taste. But these taste amazing either way. Of course, we got the sandwich itself. Bro, don't tell me that does not look good as hell. Crunch on this is insane. It tastes really good. It tastes really fresh with all the, the lettuce and uh, oh, somebody just my eye. But the lettuce and whatever um, sauce they got over here, and the tomatoes and stuff. 
this is a very popular spot, man. I think what top three rated in the U.S. or Michigan or something like that. Like, people, just, people, just, people just keep lining up here. All right, I'm gonna finish the rest of this in my car where the AC is gonna be on. I gotta drive home. I really can't. I couldn't show the car. To show you guys the rest of the car, I'm gonna, I'm gonna head back home first. I'm not really trying to do it in the middle of Detroit and everything. This is the car I got. Well, technically it's not really mine, it's the family's, but I'll be the one using it the most. It's a 2016 Toyota Corolla, and what I love about it the most is probably that I can finally drive far distances with it. Unlike my Honda CRV, which I really couldn't go more than like an hour or two away from my home with. Hopefully I can go with some fun places with this thing. It's pretty spacious back here, no cap.